less than one kilometer away from docking the Soyuz spacecraft, closing at a rate of three and a half meters per second at the correct speed. Once uh, the Soyuz docks or comes into contact and capture with the Rosfiat module on the Earth-facing side of the Russian segment of the International Space Station's Zarya module, uh, there will be a few seconds worth of uh, opportunity for the two spacecraft's relative motion to dampen out against one another. Uh, they will uh, come to a uh, stable uh, position. Uh, the two docking uh, interfaces will stop uh, relative motion, and that will enable the docking probe to be retracted, uh, basically drawing in the Rosfiat module for a hard mate, enabling hooks and latches uh, to close uh, at the docking interface and set the stage for the initiation of three hours' worth of leak checks. Station is in the center of the scan. Final approach rate nominal. Copy. Small movement of the target relative to the center of SK, but that's within nominal range. Okay, the station keeping command is uh, armed. Okay, Satoshi. Okay, go ahead and uh, again bring the image to the full screen. Okay, let Satoshi select the command. Rate nominal. Roll maneuver complete. Crosshair is aligned. Target is one cell to the right from the center of Vesca. Everything is normal. Proceeding with final approach. Standing by for contact. Target is in the center. Rate is nominal. We still have some roll left. Yes, still it remains small roll. Half cell to the right from the center of the sky, approaching the center, crosshairs aligned, standing by for contact. About two meters. Standing by, contact confirmed. Docking confirmed. confirmed. Copy. The International Space Station in free drift. Congratulations, Sergey. Okay. The hearty laugh of Mike Fossum signaling the arrival of three new residents of the International Space Station. Docking confirmed at 4.18 p.m. Central Time as the Soyuz TMA-02M and the International Space Station flew 218 statute miles to the northeast of Rio de Janeiro.